Hello, I am here with a haul. Been some time since I did a haul and that is because of some specific reasons which I want to address in this video as well as of course open the boxes that I got which are two boxes from Japan but one of them or there is both Korean and Japanese releases in these ones uh, and I also wanted to address something quite important which is why these packages are as delayed as they are new releases as well as why I haven't unboxed m much new releases on my channel and it's something that might make me need pretty much forcing me to change my channel but that is because of the Swedish postal office yeah I'll get into it I'll open these at the same time so no time will be spilled e Here we go. So this package includes ooh, used items. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> okay. I almost thought, oh, I'm going to laugh if this happens again. But I bought another used copy of I Got a Boy, and as usual, I don't know which one. But seriously, this is the third copy I've gotten of Taeyong. I, I don't know what it is with this exact copy, but for some reason I always get this one. <laughs> this is the third time. I haven't gotten duplicates of the other one. I have the group and Yuri's version as well. But yeah. <laughs> Keep on getting this one. It's kind of funny. Okay, so I also got JYJ3 Voices 2, which is the only of the DVD releases I don't have. I have the photo book edition of this one but not the DVD edition, so ye. And then I have Icon's New Kids Begin, the Jacket A and Jacket B version. Ooh, ah, they're going to unbox those. Ooh, didn't expect them to be this Gigi Pack thing, ye. Yeah, one of these from H&B. And then I have two of these editions of Dumb Dumber. I actually have more of these, but they have them coming in a big package, which I took with boat shipping, which is like, takes like two three months so yeah it's been almost two months now though with that because this one I ordered later than the other one so hopefully that package will come soon uh, but yeah two of the editions more editions are coming then I have another edition of oh, it's summertime ah. and then I have Tekyon's special winter ah. ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, mm, now that one's empty. So this one contains new releases. And yeah, the reason why this is so delayed, why both of these packages are so delayed, why I haven't really unboxed new albums on my channel, it's because the Swedish Postal Office has started with a new fee on all the uh, packages outside of Europe. I thought it was only for the Chinese, like the Chinese packages, but turns out it's for all of them. They basically did this because people are buying too much from China. They're buying things that they could buy here, but they're buying them a lot cheaper. So they started with this fee on all packages, which means that there's loads and loads of hundreds of thousands, if not millions of packages <clears throat> that they, well, they actually have to send back hundreds of thousands of packages because people aren't getting them because, you know, the fee they imposed on these packages cost more than the items they ordered so they don't collect them at all and then there is me who didn't order from China but ordered things that I can't get here in Sweden doesn't matter I still get the fee on top of you know tax as well <clears throat> so yay for that so in short what happens is these packages come to Sweden and then they get stuck in this custom thing but instead of normally they would be sent out to you and you'd pay the fee now they don't do that so they send you a slip or a letter yeah takes quite a few days for you to get that and then you pay via like a website and then you wait for many more days like these packages can be stuck for weeks even if like I did paid at once doesn't matter this has been like at the Swedish post office for like two weeks as in not my post office but the central one and then if you're lucky they send it to you 
or I don't know, they can send it back too. Apparently people who pay the fee, they send back their packages anyway, so it's chaos right now. This makes everything I order delayed and extremely expensive. So yay for that. So that's the reason why I haven't really been uploading many new releases, because when I realized this, first of all, the releases I already had ordered, they were extremely delayed. And second, if I order more things, it will be extremely expensive for me. It's not normally I pay shipping and album fee. No, I pay an expensive fee on top of everything, so every package I order will now be extremely expensive. Yay! And unlike many people who think I'm rich, I'm not. I actually don't have that money. Uh, yay! <sighs> I needed to make this announcement that I might be forced to change my channel. I will still be uploading new releases, but I will be very selective with what I, what I buy. I have pre-ordered BTS new Korean album, all the versions, because I ain't opting out of that. It may cost whatever it costs, I'm not opting out of that. And I ordered it with EMS, so hopefully that means it will be sent directly to me, because it's still EMS even though I probably have to pay a hefty fee. But they can't hold it like they can hold normal packages because it's EMS. <sighs> I'm quite frustrated, <laughs> as you might notice. Okay, I'm just gonna show you what I got because this relates to BTS as well. Because here they are, finally. <sighs> the Face Yourself BTS albums. Oh, I got the package with the DVD. So it's the DVD release and then so it's the B, C, and D version because I believe the there was two packages, who get it with the Blu-ray or the DVD. And since I don't have Blu-ray, I got the DVD package. And then it comes with this one because you got the package. So yeah, Woo. clear file. So I will be unboxing these. You'll be sure of that. Finally, I've seen you comment on this. It's like, where is the unboxing? I'm like. Believe me, I want to make this unboxing too. I've been waiting for these albums forever. Well, not forever, but for weeks and weeks, because they should have been here weeks ago. Ooh. And then I also got the My Chinkies, new chap chapter, yay. And I got this version, I don't know which version it is, but the, it's just the cover that's different. The photo book is the same for all three versions, so that's why I've only got one. Ooh, it's nice that, Ooh, it's thick. Heavy. Okay, now that's empty. All right. So yeah, which brings me to the last point that I might be forced to change my channel. As I said, I won't stop doing unboxings, but for as long as this fee thing keeps on going, I mean, I can always hope they'll stop with it, but I don't know. But for as long as this is ongoing, I'll have to be very careful with what I order because gets too expensive, but I will still be ordering new albums, but very selectively. Oh, but that brings me to another point, since you know I won't have that many unboxings to do. I still do have quite a lot of used albums to unbox, so this won't, this change won't be happening right away. Even though I will be having less new albums, I still have quite a lot of old used albums to unbox, so I'll still be having a lot of unboxings up, but I can't order like I used to. But I also wanted to, again, <laughs> can I just focus, okay. The last point I wanted to make is that I'm forced to change my channel, but then I also have some ideas what I can do instead, because I'm not letting go of my channel. I have been doing unboxings and videos on YouTube since 2013, and it's made me happier than I've ever been before. This has always been, you know, connecting with people and it has brought me a lot of, a lot of, lot of joy and I'm not letting go of that. So what I'm thinking, like, even though I won't stop doing unboxings, don't worry, I won't stop doing them, but I also want to bring in a little bit other content into my channel because I know a lot of you use my channel for ASMR like relaxing and all of that. And quite a lot of you like when I have read stories from the photo books and such. So I thought, why not start, for example, doing live streams and other things, just writing small stories. 
we can write them together or I can write them and then I'll read them like small small novels small part of a book but it's new content so you'll get it I guess you'll get books written directly <laughs> I don't know, but in live streams we can do them together, you can pitch me ideas and then I can like a storybook telling but with new content every time. So it's like I'm writing stories for you that I'm reading out for the first time, yeah, new stories. So storybook reading. Hmm. Do you think that's a good idea? I want to hear what you think because I'd love to do that. I mean, I love writing and it would be this would be the perfect opportunity for me to get back into writing as well as practice my English, of course. My English writing as a when I used to write I always wrote in Swedish. So this will be I don't know. Would you, would you like that? Because I know a lot of people find me just, my voice relaxing, so, hmm? Just, just let me know what you think, because as I said, just because circumstances forces you to change your channel, I'm not giving up on it. And I will still do unboxings, just when the old unboxings dry out, I might not have that much to unbox, but I still will have unboxings. Just, yeah, not as many new ones, for as long as this fee continues anyways. Mm. It might continue forever, who knows? Who knows? Alright. Well, let me know what you think. Ah, uh, and yes, time to do some unboxings. Alright, thank you so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. Bye!